these are the suspects. A, a pocket knife. A handkerchief with the initial. One ring to rule them all. To the <coughs> end. From R. Dawson. And partner, 1883. Dawson. I've seen this name before. Perhaps my archive holds the answer. Please don't make me do another puzzle. <laughs> I was going to say, I don't like those. Those were very good. That we found on Peter. These abbreviations. All right, so we've got that completed. Let's go find... I keep wanting to call him Neville. Mr. Holmes? Mr. Holmes? Good morning, Mr. Holmes. Can I help you? Good morning, Constable. How about it snooped like through all of your stuff? Who was arrested at Woodman's Lee last night? Ah, the young man. He's waiting in the interrogation room. You can go straight through. His belongings are held in the evidence room. Oh, I already looked at Thank him. You. Where you head are you, Bobby? Locked. Ah, okay. How did I miss this door? Mr. Holmes? <laughs> Every single one of them. Mr. Holmes? Holmes? Mr. Holmes? Does this notebook belong to you? This reminds me of L.A. Noir. Yes, but but where did you find it? I did not know. I, did not know. I, I, I thought I'd lost it at the hotel. But... What do these abbreviations mean? Oh, no. Oh, no. I beg you, I can't. If I told you, it would only make things worse. But I will find out eventually, Mr. Nelligan. The sea knife was found near Carrie's body. Tell me, Mr. Nelligan, did Mr. Carey try to defend himself or to attack you with it? I don't know. I didn't kill anyone. The police seized this valuable ring from you. Whose is it? I didn't steal it from anyone. It has always belonged to me. Uh, let's check it out. Uh, I don't remember the names. The ring's date of engraving is many years ago. You would have been a child then, hardly in any position to receive such an item from a partner. Oh. Let's check this boy out. Oh, expensive fabric. I'm literally just mashing A. Um. Ah. Short sleeves. Um. I mean, you can look at his ring finger. Well, I will see you soon, young man. Please, let me go. I'm innocent. All right, let's put a deduction together. All right. Pinned to the wall. I don't think he could have done it. Oh, I didn't even get to read it. I need to stage a reconstruction. Oh. I'm sure that Watson would be happy to. Yeah, 
Yeah, because there's no way. Oh, I guess he owns it. Oh, so, that thought it was a choice. Who is the true owner of the ring? The ring is mine. Father's jacket. Crap. So, so Mr. Nelligan. The ring is mine. All right, let's try this one more time. No, Mr. Nelligan. I believe that the ring had belonged to your father. Oh, but, but, but how do you know? The jacket you are wearing is made of an expensive fabric that only a man of exceptional wealth could afford. You do not seem to me to be a rich man, Mr. Nelligan. Furthermore, the garment is ill-fitting. It is quite clear that it belonged to someone else, most probably your father. With your father gone and taking with him the family's wealth, as a little boy you had to find yourself a manual job, and it was most probably cleaning fish. You cut your hands often while working, I can tell from the scars. I'm speechless, Mr. Holmes. It, it all happened exactly as you say. Of course. Well, I will see you soon, young man. Um, watch, Mr. Holmes, Mr. Holmes, Mr. Holmes, locked. Um, I don't know if there's anything down here for me, but let me see if anything opened up. Doesn't appear to have, but that's all right. <laughs> It's not like I'm sure like Holmes or anything. <laughs> Alright, let's go out here. That's proving nothing. That doesn't open. Mr. Holmes. Mr. Holmes. Calm down. Mr. Holmes. At your service, Mr. Holmes. All right. Well, I think we need to get out of here, and we are going back to here, I believe. Find a pair of clues and we'll form a dog There we go. Wow. <laughs> Does it though? We need to find out whether an unskilled and untrained man could be used. Right, so we need to find what's going on there. Ugh, I don't think that guy could throw that dude up against the wall. He was like double his height. And certainly probably a burly man since he was a sailor. So let's go back in there and let's try this experimente out. Which... Actually, I don't know if this is the place to do it, but let's give it a go. Or let's give it a go. Oh. Oh, there's a map. Hammerfest. Dundee. It's a whaling map. Well, is that all I need to do? One of these. That should do it. Now I am ready for the experiment. Alright, so we need to leave this place. And 
and I believe go back to Scotland Yard. 